What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jermaine3G back at it with another banger. I know I'm looking kind of rough right now. I'm gonna get a haircut soon eventually. But I don't know if I showed y'all my new room. It's the same, but I just got it like looking different. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and show y'all how everything looking. I wanna do that. And then I wanna do, well, there's no purpose of doing a room tour. Cause I wanna show y'all all the items that I have. And this rack is in my room, but it's like, it's cool though. Cause you know, I got more space in my room now. So I'ma just show y'all how everything looking. And uh, stay tuned for this bank, man, let's get it. All right, so we got this dresser from Amazon for $50. We got our YouTube plaque with the Creed, Chicago Bulls foam finger. We got another Nest fragrance, a must cop. Don't mind the water right there. We got our printed paper right there. But we're cleaning all this area out. I empty the drawers for certain things. Uh, I might do that if I end up doing a room tour. But this is what I want to show y'all. I got a little rack right here because I moved my uh, my mirror. It's gone closet. And I was going to replace it, but I wanted more space in my room. So I put my table in the closet. I'm hanging some stuff up there with my off-white robe. Princess bed right there. As y'all can see, we got the shoes up top instead of on the side. We got a little dirty clothes being on the cut. With the speaker right there. We got our rig on this bag, the boxes. But this is just a little update because instead of me getting rid of stuff, oh, we got the Batman in the book. Uh, I just won't buy anything else. Oh, yeah, we got the room we painted. So I can see ceilings repainted. All that got repainted. So that's why I got all that got repainted. As y'all can see. So yeah, that's why everything is changed the way it is. But uh we about to get on and explain each piece that we have. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Alright, y'all. So we're gonna start with the coats, even though it's summertime. I was like, I still need to keep some of these coats. So as y'all know, we have the Canadian Goose jacket. You know what I'm saying? As y'all can see, the black on black. Then we got our North Face. Uh, the Geo print. We had that not too long ago, like a year. And we got all black North Face. Now I just picked this up from Zara. Uh, it's a decent little puffer black. Then we got this Columbia and Audi collab. It's like $25. We got this Subi jean jacket, white denim. Now, honestly, was going to get the other uh, jean jacket that I had before again. It was cheaper. I was going to get it for 140 Subi got a sale. But I'm like, do I really need it? I really don't need it. Plus, I wouldn't have regular black jeans to go with it because they real tight. So, yeah, I didn't get it. I, I'm saying I'm not going to buy nothing else because I'm getting something soon. So stay tuned for that. We got an Audi Adidas jacket, windbreaker. North Face windbreaker. Then we got our Rick Owen Gimp uh, hoodie. The zip up, as y'all can see. You know what I'm saying? Then we got Nike Tech Fleece. Subi hoodie. Fair God hoodie, a uh, blow. I mean, I said Fair God, figures of speech. Virgil blow hoodie. Now I was gonna end up selling it, but I ended up keeping it. So yeah, we got our SSH hoodie still. I just added it with it. I was gonna add it to like the workout, cause I really wasn't gonna wear it like that. But I mean, we could just add it with the black. I know y'all see most of y'all black. And we got this Adidas hoodie from the Members Week. Speaking of that, Members Week is this week as well. So they gotta go to the ticket. I don't know for what, but I still enter. You never know what they gonna do. Then we got this 1017 Elite's turtleneck. We got this black Amazon Essentials uh, button up. I need I need to get the, I said a white. I need to get a black one, but we got the white one, you know what I'm saying? I think I'm gonna get the black one. I like the way these fit. We got Kari right here, Kari crew neck, Kari shirt. And then this is the most recent Kari I got. I just thought about it. These go with my regular ones that I have. So that's like, that's a good eggshell color. Then we had this Rick Owens uh, T-shirt. Then we got two Yeet shirts from the concert. You know what I'm saying? Yeet tour. Uh, now, 
We're going to skip through these. All these is my car hire shirts for work. You know what I'm saying? All these are my work shirts. You know what I'm saying? Now we got our dark shadow jogger pants. This is with the logo. And this one is without the logo. It's just they both sides medium. So that's why I kept the ones with the logo and without it. And they comfortable so I can wear them for every now and then. Nike Tech Fleece Pants Black. I still got those. Three pair of Adidas Tyro Pants. I believe these are Tyro 22. This is size medium and this is size large. That's why I got the same pants but two different sizes. Uh, some regular jeans. I don't know what them are, but I got them free. Uh, Subi jeans right here. So I can see. Got another pair of Subi jeans. I had these pairs for like three years for the longest. This pair right here. I want to say them, them the first pair of Subi jeans I had, but nah. I'm like the third pair. These some free jeans I got as well. Had these for a little bit now. All these are my cargo pants for work, so I got different colors. Then the rest are just black. These are all Wrangler uh, cargo pants. They real good quality, good everyday uh, cargo pants. Can't go wrong with them. Now we got these right here, they're the most expensive. Honestly, I think this is the most expensive clothing piece that I own, that I paid for. This is 850. And uh, for some pants, you know, who don't know for some make on pants. It came with the hanger, so I'm like, I might as well rock out the hanger and get the most value out of it. So that's pretty much it for my collection. All this, that stuff right there is like stuff that I have from my like eighth grade, my graduation, stuff that I wore. Oh, and that's a great suit that I bought. It's a great Michael Kors suit. So yeah. We got workout gear. All this stuff that I'm gonna work out in. You know what I'm saying? Once I start back working out. So, should be soon, like today. Really, but we'll see. There's some sweats that I got. My Western Illinois sweats. So, I mean, that's pretty much it. Uh, I might as well show y'all how my cabinets look now. So, this look the same. I didn't do this one yet. And my sock drawer kind of looked the same. Uh, I need to find somewhere to put this umbrella. I might hang it up in the closet somewhere. Since I don't have many of the uh, things over here, which I'm not, because, you know, it does peel off the wall if you don't undo it right. But, uh, I used to have old school shirts in here. Now I got my towels when I take a shower. And these are my everyday walk around shirts. I got them in the drawer folded up instead of hanging up. And this is like what I used to have at the top. So all that stuff down there is like, I got toothpaste and stuff. It's toothpaste in the bathroom, but it's from college. So I got toothpaste, extra toothpaste, hand sanitizer, my shoe cleaning and stuff, you know, stuff for my teeth. Then I have shorts right here, all my shorts. And then, you know, we got the underwear cabinet. All I have is Supreme underwear, Adidas underwear. And then I did this, just my hair rubber bands, coconut oil, gum, all my chopstick, box cutters that I had to work, all my different wallets. I got my mask here, gloves, you know, stuff like that. My ski mask right there. Now this is a, the main thing that I changed. So I still got my book bag over here. But my top drawer, that's where my cologne is. Top two drawers, I bought some more. Then we got soap right here. You know what I'm saying? Got the soap with the more cologne. And here go all the soap right here, mixed with the other. Oh, okay, so that's why. So this is off course. Uh, let me put it back on course, I'm gonna keep recording. All right, so I just fixed it and put it back on course. You know what I'm saying? It came off. But as y'all can see here, we got 
a year of life supply of those. So, you know, hygiene gotta stay important. You got the lotion, the body wash, uh, nail clippers down there, all uh, the metro deodorant. Mentioned the order pretty good. Now, last but not least, we got my accessories. So, what I meant to do is put my belts down here as well. So, I got my Rick Owen belt, which I might as well do it now while I'm thinking about it. And I'm gonna put them in a box that way. I'm gonna keep my hats in here, but I wanted to take my uh, my Alex box out and my Rick Owen box. And I still got that Michael Kors tie. I never wore it, bro. That's tough. And I might put these in there first. But hopefully these could fit. You know, I'm going to find somewhere to put them in where they all could fit. Put these back in here. And then that way we have a little more space to work with. And here. But that's pretty much it for the tour. So let me know what you guys think. In the comment section down below, do y'all like what I did to my room? You know, things like that. You know, like how everything painted, you know what I'm saying? We got the, the shine, I forgot what it's called. It's called the shine, some paint shine, something like that. But yeah, man, we're gonna leave the rack in here for now. Bad, perfect. Uh, that's pretty much it for my inventory. Like I said, we got some things coming up uh, that I'm not gonna speak too much on right now. But just know the content on this channel is going to get 10 times better. And um, yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video. I'm out. Gang, gang.